There's a squirrel out on the infield. And unfortunately for the Indians, that squirrel represents probably as much activity as the Indians have had on the base pass today. That little guy now is coming down to the third baseline. He's heading for home. Oh, he's got a quick first step. <laughs> he's going to go behind the umpire. Even he says, I don't like you. He's heading for where? No one's getting near him. It could be the foam coming out of his mouth <laughs> and the <laughs> snarl that he's presenting. How does he get in the building? And the squirrel's trying to jump up and climb the backstop. C.B. Buckner yanks his mask off and says, you're out of here. He has thrown the squirrel out of the game. They open the gate. The squirrel says, ha. He comes back towards C.B. Buckner. He's going to get in the last couple of words. Now he's moving to his left. Back up the third base line. He's feels like he may have missed third, so he's going to go back, touch it, and come back home. Nobody is going out to try to get this squirrel. I mean, it is not a mountain lion. But everybody is backing away from this squirrel as if this were Simba. And he hasn't eaten in four months. And we're just going to stand here and watch the squirrel? Somebody has to do something. Paul Molitor's coming out of the dugout saying, come on, have somebody get the squirrel off the field so we can play ball. C.B. Buckner says, have you had your rabies shots? I'm not going near that thing. And now the squirrel is down the first baseline, darting toward the Twins' dugout. I have no idea why there isn't something being done, though, to get the squirrel out of here. And the squirrel is now between the mound and home plate. And Brandon Kanky, the head of the ground crew, is out there talking to Field and Culbert. Says, I I'm not touching that thing. Four to one, Twins lead the Indians. And for Indians fans, this is about... The most they've had to get excited about this weekend because Minnesota Twins pitching has been so dominant, holding the Indians to one run in the two ball games, and that one run coming on a wild pitch. By the way, the squirrel is down the third base line, heading for left. Ground screw is now chasing it. This ought to be something. Yeah, if they can funnel them to the elephant doors, I think they're in business. Bugger now is making some moves. And now it's down by the grandstand down the left field line. And this is where you got to be careful. That thing comes up. It did. It jumped into the seats. Oh. Oh. Well, free t shirt day here today. And one lucky fan's going to be able to take home Bucky the Squirrel. Now, nobody knows where the squirrel is anymore, but the grounds crew says, well, he's not on the field. I don't care. <laughs> so they're heading back to home, and Jose Barrios having to take some warm-up throws. This might be the only thing that throws Jose Barrios off his game. 